<laughs> what is up my AMC family? Jabul Mike coming at you from. Okay, I'm not at AMC Movie Theaters as you can see. I'm also not at home as well as you can see. Well, I'm currently in Kingman, Arizona, taking care of some family business with the grandparents and all in all, just a beautiful day. It's phenomenal. The weather out here is spectacular. You can see the scenery in the background is just, it doesn't get better than this, okay? It's just, I just love being here. It's, it's, it's breathtaking, <laughs> okay? So there's a lot of animals and, and so I'm not gonna get too far into that, but you see one of my last videos, I think it was like around Christmas time. I was talking and there was some deer in the background just trying to roll up on me, okay? So now a couple of things I do wanna mention. Uh, number one, this is not financial advice and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, okay? Now I'm gonna give you a couple of things and I want you to be very careful. Okay, first and foremost, CVM. If you missed out, if you see it, don't chase it, okay? If you were early on the boat or if you got in and you had a nice little pump and you took some profits, congratulations, you made some money. Do not go out chasing CVM simply because if that boat's already passed, you don't want to chase it. You put your money in, has a retracement, and um, you know, you're know you going to be left in the dust. It's going to be in the rear view and you're going to be upset and you're going to have um, maybe be down on yourself. And if you're down on yourself, you're not making smart decisions. And if you're not making smart decisions, then you're going to start making bad decisions. Bad decisions lead to losing money and on and on because the retail investor, again, is always last to know. Now, here's something that I want to talk to you about and just put this out there. Volatility in the market, we know that's a given. This week, okay, if you look at Market Watch, the economic calendar, there's a lot of people from the Fed talking, okay? They're gonna be speaking about what is going on and they're gonna have the two cents. But what's most important, I tell you, Jay Powell is speaking on Thursday. With Jay Powell speaking on Thursday, this man can sway a gauntlet in any direction. He can, uh, he's hawkish, he can come out and just, just devour a whole market and just turn bloody red by a few words. This man has all the power right now and who knows what he's gonna say on Thursday. Now, for me, I'm remaining patient. If you feel the need to put money into the market, just wait till this man speaks, please, okay? Now, I can't tell you what to do, but just remain patient, remain calm. Jay Powell speaks on Thursday. Now, in between time, you know, there's gonna be a lot of swings, a lot of volatility. Um, I get a lot of questions too um, in my DMs and people messaging me, you know, what about SoFi? SoFi's down to that $7 range. It hasn't hit six bucks, and if it has, I missed that. But even if it hits six dollars, okay, in the high sixes, maybe mid sixes, it hasn't got there yet. But I personally believe that so far, will probably hit the high sixes and to the mid sixes, possibly to the low sixes. So for me, even if it breaks seven dollars, I'm not going to be entering or buying any more shares of so far. What I'm going to do is remain patient, remain calm, and wait for a good spot, okay? Now, if the market continues to push down, obviously so far at a great price. I believe in it in the long haul, and that's what I'm going to end up doing, okay? So you got to remember the retail investors always last to know the market's very volatile. And don't be rushing to put into positions um, that you're gonna end up losing the money on because the market is just, it goes up and down in a heartbeat with everybody from the Fed talking this week. Jay Powell up on Thursday. There's nasty, nasty volatility and the retail investors always last to know, okay? So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And now leave me a comment. Let me know, um, just let me know what state you're from, okay? I'll see you very soon. And hopefully I can make a video later because there's tons of information I need to give, but I can't because family comes first. All right, God bless everybody. Take care, peace.